Hello guys, I am here back in with another new video and today I am going to show you a framework that is based on React. Yes, React is not a framework itself, although many of us consider it as framework just, just because it have, a, it have a lot more functionality like a framework, but it's not a framework, it's a library, it's a library of components, okay. so we have today a really great uh, uh that framework that is totally built upon react let me show you the framework and let you guys decide if you like it or not because uh, this have something great in it that's why i am showcasing it so let's just see it so before showing you the framework and uh, the actual framework itself let me show you what they have created using it as you can see it it is a demo app here you can see both of the uh, demos here like a b2b next.js app so obviously you can use next.js with this app as well like with this framework as well and as you can see it here they have front like front end like customer side and user side end and uh, the admin panel as well you can see those here and these are uh, those website in full screen you can see it here like a really really great website like totally modern design modern cool looking design great colors and all and here is the admin panel as you can see it here and it's totally ready industry ready okay you can just use it your like pull on all pull on all of those templates and this is working actually see rejected successfully or if i accept here it opens where the map is so yep it's almost ready to grow ready to go thing uh, solution okay so so uh, as you guys i think already have guessed here you can see the name of the framework this is this uh, name uh, the name of this framework is refine and as you can see it here refine offers a lot of out of the box functionality as we can see it here and uh, rapid development without compromising extreme cus customizability obviously you can see it here how much customized it is and it's it really looks great and it ships with and design system and and design system is industry standard i know and many of us love it but uh, i have i am a bit skeptical about it because it's not updating for a long time now but oh sorry 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 you're gonna you're gonna hear a bump in the sound sorry i'm really sorry but uh, yeah here it comes with and design system building and it's really really great and the most important thing is that they have all explained here that that is you can see the tutorial section here as well so they have provided us tutorials that is the most important thing to have when you are developing a, a not a website like a framework or some piece of uh, code that is going to be reused so it's really important that they have provided tutorials and here you can see your api is supported out of the box you can connect with raised graphql uh custom backends or uh it has built-in support of next.js card Airtable, strappy strappy graphql superbase hasura and altogic as well so yeah a tons of things and another thing that i gonna appreciate about them that is decoupled ui so ui components are export exposed directly without encapsulation you have full control over it so sometimes what happens some of the ui components that a library or a framework provides that is not totally accessible or customizable 
and that creates a lot of lot of problem when creating a specific website like fitting uh, following a certain design or something like that but here they have provided decoupled ui so i am gonna like that and giving them a point for that as well and rather than that that's it that's it about this website that's it about this framework uh i don't know how much i gonna use it but i gonna sure try it for even a small project but this is meant to be for bigger projects which have a lots of complexities so can be a good use case for our next client project whenever we gonna get a bigger client project like for a totally complex app we can create something like this obviously so we gonna use it then for that time for further that time i'm gonna tinker a bit with it also so that's it that's it for this video if you like my videos in general please do subscribe to my channel please visit this website and comment down below if you like it or not and rather than that if you know other if you know about some of the great website or framework open source framework like this or any other project development developing stuff or software stuff any other apps design stuff entrepreneurship stuff anything please let me know about all of them in the comment section below so i can feature them as well in my future videos so bye for now Thank you.